JD, what's one thing that you're going to have your eye on? I think about what the great coaches of the past right, always do this. said. The key to any ball game. Please let me play defense first. And protect yours. So let me play well, defense case, first. Perfect. These teams get after the quarterbacks. I'm watching the pass rush. Justin Tucker set to boom this one away. And off we go in Madden Ultimate Team. goes here Adams Come on. and now we're gonna get a time sorry guys called by the defense uh, they'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter come on Do this. Now a first right. down throw. Watson. That'll be caught by Rice. And he's able to get Good tackle from Marty. Two brought down there. Seven yards, the pickup on the pitch and catch. QB. I think defensively you're okay with that. You're in the first quarter. He's going to get some catches, but they rallied to him quickly. And that's what you count on. And I like what you just said. First quarter, mm. can you do it all game long? Dion. They catch it, big you hit. tackle them, they go down on the spot. Because when all you're right. able to do that and you don't give up big chunks of yardage after the catch, now you put the offense in a position where every series they have to work hard to pick up first downs and you tend to stall them out when you do that now yep. Bell. nope and nowhere to go blown up. blown up he'll lose yardage Don't try back that. at the 38 that's gonna go as a loss of a yard and it'll be second down nice play right there to stop him behind the line but i want to see how this defense continues to play him here in the first half yeah we know you know better than i he has oh, the ability to take you gotta hit him harder so what do you do i know jerry rice sure that you i've used him, him in Every single levels. time, because if you crowd, he catches a ball, the he, ca he, he, breaks through, he makes the catch, but he fumbles while at now it. Now a first down carry by Bell, and he's going to be met at about the 43. Give him three on first down, it'll set up a second and seven. Well, I think that's what they're going to need to do here in the first half. You've got to take some pressure off of this young quarterback. And oh, no better... Peppers. And what a monster. What a monster, Picked Peppers. Here, the 32. And they are going to set up shop at the 32-yard line. How about the big boys snagging one? You don't see that every week. No, you don't. But a lot of them are just reliving their old dreams, going back to when they were in youth football and in high school. They didn't always play defensive line. Some of them actually handled the football. And you can see the flashback when he grabbed that one. So after the INT, it's Rodgers. The left side Let's go, Julio. That was a cheeky play. play. A great job pulling that one in from a guy, as we know, who that can really been blaze. Kicked. He's got a lot of speed. And that speed can work for him so many different ways. Sometimes he just takes off and goes and just runs past people. Sometimes you get people to back off so far that you can catch everything underneath. But still, at some point in the game, you probably have to make some contested catches, right? Let's go. You have to go up and beat a defender for the football. He has that in his arsenal as well. Showed it right there. 23 yards on the play. Not only have they completed a couple on this drive, but they peeled off some pretty good chunks of yardage, too. Absolutely great start. Two nice plays in the pass game. Now can they continue to feed off that? No, no, no. On first down, Rodgers. Throw left Imagine. side complete. Ooh. It's Harris. And touchdown. he's into the end That's zone for the receiving yeah. touchdown. Franco Harris from 21 yards away. And his guys have taken a first quarter lead. That's the only reason I have to Tucker go. able to connect on the extra point. And it's now a 7 0 game. He's not really a fullback, he's a running back. Here's Tucker now out I know to a lot of people have been away. arguing, like, is he a fullback, running back? He's a, he, he's a running back. 
And now out comes Houston. And there are parts of their last drive they'd like to emulate. And, of course, they'd like to forget the inning, the interception. But they did put together, Charles, a nice sustained drive to get him down the field. Yeah, and unfortunately for them, the only thing that matters is part two, right? Because once they threw the interception Let's go, and finished Jamal. off the drive, Dion that does them no good to go back and say, well, you know, Dion is the going. best. Finish things off. That's the only way you can get it done. And the first play of the drive there is incomplete. Oh, throwing easy, again. Easy. It's Watson. That's cool. Throw left side. Completion to Rice. Come on. And they else. get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40 yard line. Give him 17 on the pick up there, and the Texans also get a new set of downs. Hey, down, down. On first down, Watson. Looking left side, and he's got a man. It's Rice. Chewing up big yardage. Another nice gain there. This one goes for 20. There goes Jerry Rice again, racking up catches and bunches. His 1,549 catches are whopping 224 more than the next closest guy, the great Tony Gonzalez, a terrific Dang. tight end. And he works it past the 30, almost to the 25. Right, I'm gonna try something 11 else. more yards that go around, a first down as well. On. Down, it's Watson. Throw left side complete. That's Rice. And down inside the 15. He's going to run that play the whole game. Another nice gain. 16 right. yards well, there. Oh, it's my job to stop. Again. So. Kudos to him. Dion. Cam. Jalen. Taylor. The Texans with the first opportunity now from the red zone. They've got a first and 10 at the 11. They'll run it now, out of the gun. So he got free of one tackle, but couldn't do a whole lot else. Yeah, give him four yards there, it'll be second and six. Well, that call makes sense because they've been throwing it well on this drive, and once again, they show passing formation, showing the shotgun. Then they ran out of it. That was a nice play by them defensively, though, to hold it to a short game. And it's caught, and he's able to get it down to the two-yard line. That catch good for five. It's third down. Down Not two running backs. We'll All right, nice cool. In route. With those faster passes when they're going that fast, any hesitation as a quarterback that the deflection, if you miss, might be bigger and lead to an interception? Yeah, and the deflection works both ways. Maybe a defender gets a hand in the way and it pops in the air, and sometimes you throw it so hard your receiver can't handle it, and he pops it up in the air for the defenders to grab as well. But a moot point there is they were able to connect. This will be play number seven on the drive. Third and a yard. Now Watson going to sneak it. And he's in for the score. Touchdown. Texas. I didn't know that worked, but okay. Deshaun Watson. So I had everybody. That's fine. That's fine. On the quarterback sneak. Oh, it's a fake. They'll try and throw for it. And the Texans are an extra point away from tying this Damn. football game. And he'll okay. get into the end zone as a two point conversion His, is my successful. opponent's being a cheeky. Out to kick this one I like it though. Like, as much as I want to hate on him and whatnot, I like what he's doing, bro. That's the way you want to live. And now back out comes the offense. Do what you got to do. And for them, a touchdown their last go around. Obviously, they'll be hoping to do that again. And when you start plotting for this drive, when you start thinking to yourself, okay, what are we going to do? You don't go away from what you did before because that worked. But you have to be prepared for wrinkles and counters because you know they'll make some adjustments. Throwing on first down is Rodgers. And he's going to go down. The Texans come I should have threw it earlier. And able to bring him to the ground. Jadevian Clowney in there to get him for what will be a loss of 13 yards. Now Rodgers throwing on second down. Flush to his right. Now he's going to throw it deep to the other side of the field. And the hit jarred it loose. It's incomplete. Well, that certainly looked like something that they discussed all week in practice getting ready for this one. Take the big shot right out of the gate. At worst, 
you'll open up the defense a little bit, loosen them up, have them back on their heels. On third and long, it's Rodgers. And he's going to go down right near the goal line. The Props officials look at each other. They're going to mark him at the one-yard line. As I was watching the play unfold, my eyes immediately went to the referee because I wanted to see, was he going to put those two hands over his head and that <laughs> universal signal for a safety? But it's at the one-yard line. You know you're playing with fire when you get sacked that close to the goal line. A good return there. Call it 13 yards. And the Texans will take over with a first and 10. And here comes the Texans now. And they're hoping to redo their efforts of the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you have to go over and look at the tab and see what you did on the last drive. When you scored points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven. Leaves them with a second and three. Now contact up front as penalty markers come in. Who is this against? A free five yards as the defense jumps. I know it's an anticipation game for them, but it's also a reaction game, and they reacted poorly on that one. After the penalty, a fresh set of downs. It's first and ten. After the penalty, it's Bell. And Come on, Bell. 36-yard line here. Right. Eight yards on the pickup, and now they'll have some options on second and short. I think you mentioned in the opening drive that these guys needed to establish the run, protect the young QB. I actually wrote that down, believe it or not. So how would you assess things so far? I'm kind of touched that you actually wrote something like that down. <laughs> I appreciate that, partner. But I do think they've been able to do that. Maybe not as effectively as they've wanted to, but I think we'll see more of as this game goes along because they want to continue to take care of that young QB. They'll run it now out of the gun. And not much of a long as he gets it down to about the 24 yard line. For anybody that knows how to stop the, the run, please let me the know tackle how. I've been struggling with this all year. Well, we know he's an electric runner. Right. Earlier this half, we were wondering, you were wondering how they were going to bottle him up at different levels. That was your suggestion. Some mixed results. Yeah, certainly, because we have seen him bottled up at times. We've seen him play him very well. We've also seen him pop the cork a few times and get out of there, haven't we? We have indeed. Watson now to throw. Man open, Rice! A pickup of 11 and a Texans first down. Watson now 7 of 10 here in this first half, and he's got a first and 10. They'll go back to the ground with Bell. And strong running there as he's inside the 10 and down to the 8-yard line. Five yards on the carry. Good pickup on first down. Hey, when you get good yardage like that on first down, it really does a whole lot of good for your entire offense. But I love the way he's finishing those runs. At the end of things, he's making sure he gets just a little bit extra. And he'll be stopped just outside the 5 at the 6. He got half of what he needed there, two yards, and it'll bring up a third and two more. And this is why aggressive defensive coordinators love to blitz. It wreaks havoc because they end up taking their attention to the blitzers, freed up the D linemen to make the play. They'll run it with Bell. And wow. He's in. Okay. Touchdown, Houston. I'm choking right now. Le'Veon Bell, a six yard touchdown run, and the Texans will add on to their lead. I know the play ends up in the end zone with one person carrying the ball, but how about that big mass of humanity that guided him to that spot? Yeah, they got there, but I love the dive. Always a fan of the dive. I'm gonna call some different this will be players. taken to the back of the end zone. <laughs> and the decision to bring it out will cost him about five yards as this he'll hole. get this only back to the 20. Now this offense ready to head back out there. And on the last go around, they really couldn't get anything going. They had to punt from deep inside their own territory, which means you're going to lose the field position battle as a general rule. What they're looking for now is a little more consistency. Move the ball at least a few times on offense, get a couple of first downs, and hopefully flip the field. Yeah, just something to build off of. That's what they're looking for here. Rodgers now on first down, being chased out left. He's airing it out for Williams. That's going to be knocked away and incomplete. 
But one thing that I've liked defensively is they've shown them a lot of different looks here in the first half. They've this come after them. They've sat back. I think that's what you need to do to keep an offense guessing. And they certainly have kept them on their toes. That's why they haven't had much success on the scoreboard. Oh, my gosh. And it's intercepted. Picked off by Ryan Shazier. And he is going to get this one back to the 20-yard line. That interception sets them up beautifully already in the red zone. And you can hear it all the way up here. Oski, Oski, everyone turn to block, find a spot. And now they're set up inside the red zone for their offense. What? Vaughn. And brought down, but not before they get it inside the 10 to the 7. A solid pickup of 13 sets them up first and goal. Now Bell. And he'll take this one in Yard. for a Texans touchdown. Le'Veon Bell with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Texans will extend their lead. Extra point by Anderson up and good. And the decision to just kick the extra point winds up successful. Gano out to kick this one away. Now this offensive unit ready to see what they can do here. And what do you think goes on here in this situation? If you got the football, you're trailing, you're back in your own territory with just a little time. Do you try something? You're thinking about jump-starting your team, right? You just mentioned it. They're down. They're trying to get back into the game. But you've got to figure if something goes wrong, you may have put yourself in a spot where you... I can't throw it away. He's taken down. J.J. Watt. I don't want to get in that. and run him down for what will be a loss of 15 yards. Sacks a growing theme in this first half. This is second and long. 12, 12, 14, 14, a first throw for the backup, Wilson. Looking deep for Julio. And that is incomplete. 16 seconds now on the clock. The Pro Bowl wideout Julio Jones is intended receiver. And it's third down. From the gun, it's Wilson. He's going to rifle one deep left side. And that's incomplete. Clock stops. I'm going for it. There's 10 left. seconds left. This might be a stupid play, but... And how about this? Oh, well. Fourth and long, and they're going to go for it. They do go for it. It's Rodgers. He's going to fire one deep over the middle. And that is incomplete. Two seconds left on the clock. A surprising move to go for it. Predictably, at least somewhat predictably, it doesn't pay off. And now, goodness, possession's going to go over right at the 10-yard line. To throw is Watson. Give me that. Into heavy traffic, and it's intercepted. All right, there we go. Anticipation and a short return to you know the six-yard like yeah. line. So we have reached halftime here. It's the visitors, the Texans, out in front. As we'll send you eastward to Orlando, standing by with that EA Sports halftime report. Now is Jonathan Coachman. Take it away, Coach. I just want to run it back. Now this offense about ready to take yeah, over I mean, again. Like, and last time they were very fortunate this offense. They went for it on four, turned it over in their own territory. But the other guys held up. They didn't give up any points. So how about the guy with the number one headset on the sidelines, the head coach? <laughs> that was planned going into it. Not necessarily to not get the first down or to, to have the defense have to hold but it up. But he trusted his defense. Yeah. Trusted his defense very much. That was a I think terrible that play call. Play this game. Go for we'll it. Take Be it aggressive first. because I've got the wild bunch backing me up over here on my own side. <laughs> now we'll see what his offense can do. They'll throw on first down with Wilson. Check down. He's going to rifle one deep left side. So they took a shot on first down but couldn't connect. They have not gotten him going at all. Tried to spark something there with a longer throw. Unable to complete it. But you have to keep trying. He's one of their best playmakers. No matter what it says on the scoreboard, you're always trying to get him the football. Oh, Escaping the pressure right. And seeing nowhere to throw, he chucks this one away from harm. Incomplete. 
Now it's third down. Not too many things get to a quarterback of this magnitude, but I think it's safe to say that pressure can get to any quarterback. Now he's obviously a great franchise quarterback, but felt the pressure, threw it incomplete. He finds Beckham complete. And he'll be Let's taken go. down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. Uh, 15 yards this. through the air and a first down. Does he know about this? Rodgers again now. Kind of does. Oh! Are we covered. serious? It's intercepted. Picked off at the 47. And a terrific return as he takes this thing all the way down near the 20 yard line. Oh, and I saw the pressure coming at him. That just looked problematic. Hit him as he threw it, and the interception ensued. Let me pay homage to the man who stood in this spot before. He always talked about how much pressure is in the face of a guy, and can he pick. step into it? And got his man. It's caught. Touchdown, that? Houston. Taylor? Jerry Rice right. from 21 Taylor, yards away. To, and the Texans use the short field to their advantage as they cash in for six. But well, what a quick turnaround there. They get the football. Next play, boom, touchdown. I've been in a situation before where a turnover occurs, and if you're over on the bench with your defensive mate and you talk about what to do on your next series, and all of a sudden you hear sudden change, you've got to get out on the field and defend right away. Not everyone is mentally prepared to go. Is that what is yelled on the sidelines a lot of times? That, among other things. <laughs> Maybe some words we can't share here. Yeah, we'll, we'll just keep this one PG. Yeah, CC sure violation. Just, no doubt. Well, Out comes okay. this offensive yeah. unit as they get I'm set to take game. over here. Even and following the interception, the just year. any interception, are you a little bit more cautious when um, you start that next drive? Yeah. Or no, you just throw that out the window. I think you are. I don't All think right. that there's any way you can run Graham back out there and go, ah, totally didn't affect me. Just go ahead and be loose with the football again. You're going to take care of it, but you have to be careful about being too cautious okay. because now you can't run any you got Tyron offense. over there. I we'll almost threw a pick again. Him here. Now, meanwhile, a pass that should have been intercepted, but it winds up falling incomplete. Rodgers again here on second and ten. How did he just blitz here right through my... Taken down. So one quick, easy analysis about why they've struggled so far. They keep putting themselves in third and long situations. They just took another sack right there. And the offensive film session tomorrow may be a little longer than it normally is. <laughs> Not a lot of positive grades will be handed out thus far. Flushed out right. Looking downfield for Jones. He's got a man complete. Come on. All the way down to the 36-yard line. Something. It's a big play there on third down. 52 yards. So how about this for a change in field position? From inside the 10, here's first down on the other side of the field. On first and 10, here's Rodgers. Dancing to his left. Pushing through the contact. Incomplete. I'd love to know what he's saying in the huddle now to his guys up front because it's been a steady stream of pressure on him this entire game. That time, able to avoid the sack, but he's got to talk to his offensive line and say, guys, just a couple seconds extra, please. Under pressure, and the Texans able to get in there for the sack. Jadevian Clowney in there to get him again. The third time he sacked him here tonight. Third and long. It's Wilson. Play call. Steps away to his left. He's going to run, but he's got. And I think the ball's out. And this is going to get out of bounds. So they will gain a bit of yardage on the play, actually. And they'll hold on to the football as well. Now, I have to admit, partner, that I've often thought that I don't like this rule where the offensive player fumbles the ball, it goes out of bounds, and they get to keep it. <laughs> that's just because you're a defensive guy. That's why you don't like it. Yeah, you're right. It is a slanted view, isn't it? But that's this is where, for the offensive team, the sideline is their friend. Usually it's not their friend. Yeah, exactly right. Oh! And a big loss here as he's taken down. J.J. Watt in there to drop him for his 
I'm going to play this guy again. Second now here tonight. So they've gone for it twice now on fourth down of this game, and both times need him again. I need to know how to stop this. I wish we could hear the headsets now between the head coach and the offensive coordinator. Now that they're over two, he's gonna be right there. Ooh. Head coach might say, "Hey, you got anything for this one?" Might get radio silence back. He didn't catch that, did he? Meanwhile, they take a shot to start the drive, but this is gonna wind up incomplete. And that's one he's got to be happy to have back. There wasn't a hole open in the zone. You'd have to think on early downs like that first down there. Need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah, fortunately for him, got a couple more downs to play with. That one caught by Tyreek Hill. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. I have him manned up if I don't. That his first catch so far. They've held him under wraps, but he's got a first down there. They'll run it now out of the gun and give him about three as he gets it down to the 22 yard line. Third quarter, and you've got the lead. You're not ready to go into that four minute offense to close the game out, but a running game can really benefit your team right now. Here's Watson now on second down, eluding the pressure right. Oh, and the contact oh, by sliding and wind up with positive wow, yardage. It's a okay. gain of three, but now it's third um, down. Nice job there defensively. A great time Sorry, to dial up a blitz. And give him credit under center instead of throwing it away. Actually a pretty good job of getting past the line of scrimmage, not losing yardage. Watson just beating the play clock. Over the middle, that's caught by Rice. And he'll be brought Someone's down, but a tip of the please. cap on the spin move as that gives him a first down. Fourth quarter, are we there yet? Yeah, well. We got a yard off of that. Yard line. Credit him okay. with a one yard gain there to make it second and nine. That's someone who's pretty happy right there. That's the defense coordinator. Body after body getting to him before he can get started. To throw on second is Watson. And that is He's dotting me. Touchdown, He's dotting me. Texans. He's dotting me. Jerry Rice, his second touchdown of the night. And the Texans will add on to their lead. So another score there. And often you talk about the three phases of the game. Defense, offense, special teams. It's been a clean sweep in this one, hasn't it? It certainly has. They've been pretty dominant throughout this game. And privately, the head coach will add a fourth phase. That's the coaching, and he'll tell the ownership that as he tries to negotiate a new contract off of this win. They are looking strong here in the fourth quarter. And here now the offense heading back out there. And last time out, went for it on fourth down, turned it over, gave him great field position, turned it to six points, so they've got to recover here, Charles. It's amazing what one decision can do in the chain of events, right? The decision to go for it on fourth down. Caused all of that. It caused every bit of it, but it showed confidence. We, hey, we caught it. confidence what a in beast. you guys. Go pick it up for them. Didn't happen. Also showed confidence in the defense. They didn't pick up their end of the bargain. So now they've got to come back out and start over and rebuild that confidence. Rodgers now on first down. Flush to his right. Now he'll let it go deep right side. And that's caught inside the 35. He got 29 yards that time. Offense for them has been at a premium. You wonder where plays like that have been all game long. They're thinking the exact same right. thing themselves, <laughs> but they're also looking First forward now with, uh, because now these plays okay. are really for next Back week down. trying to get some momentum going. And left side here, it's Graham. And he'll be brought down at the 27-yard line. Seven yards the I might get the on new the pitch Graham. and catch. This game just keeps I just evolving don't know and changing, like, high balls, I don't Do you they work? Do they not work? Not necessarily using a big body on him. Sometimes you take a corner. A better oh, cover guy. And wow. Rogers okay. intercepted a third time. Picked off by Ryan Shazier. Oh, and he brings it back that. to right around the 26-yard line. Well, this, this defensive pressure has been constant all game long. The pass rush, rush, the coverage. They've all Madden been excellent. And now they'll tack on an interception here as this one continues to slip just further and further I don't know, out man. of hand. It, it just doesn't feel right. After the interception, here's Watson. A screen to Bell. He spins free. And he'll get to the 29-yard line brought down there. 
Only three there on the screen. It's second down. On second down, it's Bell. Not much room here as he only gets it to about the 30. Two yards on the carry there, and it's going to lead him to third down. Well, they had that one sniffed out. Excellent run blitz. Stopped that one for a short gain. What makes a good run blitz a good run blitz? The ability to stay on task, to follow up your assignment, go to the gap you're supposed to cover, and not be deterred uh, by anything else. Now on third down, so that funny. pass knocked down in the backfield and incomplete. Oh, that's got to frustrate him a little bit because they nearly got to him there, and it would have been the first sack of the game. Instead, they're able to influence the release, and they did force the incomplete pass. Here's Watson. Yep. Damn we'll take those. Incomplete. Bill O'Brien rolls the All dice. Right, I need a score no before avail. the game. And the ball will go over on downs on the short side of the field. So first and ten now from the thirty. On first and ten, it's Wilson. Nowhere to turn here, and he's going to He just go came down. screaming. Let's see that replay. Hold on. Line. That right now. That's a defeated team out there. I think you can see it totally in their body language. Okay. I'm telling you, these offensive lines this year, they don't block for anything. Yeah, this team has been thoroughly beaten right from the word Like, go. everybody decides to block Shed for some reason this year. On second down, here's Wilson. <laughs> Look at that. Like, he just gave him, like... Jadevian Cloudy in there Nothing. again. Like, My goodness, that is now his fourth sack tonight. Needs something from deep in the bag of tricks here after first and second down went backwards. It's third and very long. From the shotgun, Wilson. And he is out of bounds, but not before he's inside the 30. 14 yards, but they're still well shy of a first as that leads to fourth down. Let's go, let's go. If you run an out route, it's likely. You end up near the sideline. And what did we just see there? The toe tap. You got it. The benefits of practice. Toe tapping, foot dragging, picking it up, and making sure it was a catch. Uh, no reason not to try it there, and they do indeed convert on fourth. They're going to need to get up and set in a hurry. On first down, Wilson. Oh, and that's Odell. incomplete. Clock stops with 10 seconds left. He was looking for Odell Beckham that time. And it's second down. Another wayward pass. You know, things started out poorly in this game, and to be frank, they just really haven't gotten much better. And all that does is embolden a secondary. Let's go. And that is caught. Well, they're yeah. going to see this one at the end. They get a score, but pretty much an exercise in futility right now. Still down big. That's why you've got your star out I there. I the ball to him. They did. did. But That's simply I'm sorry, saying, guys. We don't care what coverage you put um, out there. I'll take an L today. He's so good. We're going there with the football anyway. I'll take an L. There's not a thing yeah. you can do about it. Inside the 